We are here today at the Emirates Financial Towers as we attend an event from XDC Network talking about the redefining payments on how blockchain is shaping the future of transactions. And I'm still your host, John F. Dong, and together, let's explore what this event has to offer. Uh, you see more and more companies in that space and I think this is like the main use case right now in the blockchain technology, it's like payments. Uh, so as a XDC network, we want to be at the forefront of it and I believe we are. I mean in that space right now you have Ripple, you have Stellar, Grant, but I really believe that XDC really has its role to play and will be one of the top leaders maybe alongside Ripple in that space here. Yeah. The new age way of transferring money from one country to another country is using stable coin where the money is collected in fiat currency, yeah. is converted into a crypto which is a stable coin. Mm -hmm. That stable coin is transferred into the destination country and on that destination country again the stable coin is off ramped into the local currency. I think uh, there are some very good uh, use cases that blockchain has for payments. The biggest and I think the most used right now mm -hmm. is cross-border payments. Uh, cross-border payments globally, usually you have two or three main uh, payment rails, mm -hmm. but with cross-border payments using stable coins, it becomes much easier. It's trackable, it's you know trustless, and it's much faster and cheaper. Mm -hmm. But then other new use cases about tokenization of real world assets or you know smart contracts will just make it uh, make basically re revolutionize like you said the payments ecosystem Thanks to these speakers, we've learned something new. And that's me again, John F. Dong, your host. Don't forget to follow us here at Pinoy Web3 TV. And for more questions, for more requests, please do leave it out there in the comments. And yeah, that's it. Signing off.